So if you're wanting to check out Austin, but you don't want to feel like you're staying in Austin, you want sort of the nature feel, uh, McKinney Falls is a pretty good stop. Once you have the Texas State Park Pass, it's about 20 bucks a night to stay here. We've got some great privacy here, definitely no complaints. You're gonna get the picnic table and the fire pit, some woods around you, um, it's nice. Look at you. <laughs> You're a farmer. <laughs> you got your overalls on, don't you? You're a swimming farmer. You got your swimming suit and your overalls. What could you do? You could feed the chickens and then you could go for a swim. We could get that off and go swim. Yep. You wanna go to the lake? Yeah. Let's go get in the van. Come on. This way. So if you've never been to Austin, this is a huge park. This is honestly one of the biggest city parks we've been to. I have no clue, and it's huge. <laughs> There's like just the dog park area is bigger than most of the parks we've been to. And then they've got like a train that goes around the whole thing. They've got Barton Springs Pool. <laughs> oh, now Hensley's getting, getting gutsy. You gonna do it again, Hensley? No. <laughs> We're here for the paddle boarding though. You ready to get on the water? Uh huh. Trying something new? It's already had this pump we use for our tires, so I bought an adapter for this, and I'm gonna see how that works this time. I heard some good and then some not so good things. This is the thought I got. This is like a little thing that twists into the paddle board and then uh, it's supposed to attach to the compressor here, so. Hey, it's Lady. <laughs> Thoughts so far, it's been seven, eight minutes. I was totally done last time. I'm guessing this is maybe two thirds done. Marissa's actually started on this after, and I think it's farther along than the pump is. And so even though this is a crazy heavy duty pump, uh, it restricts the airflow so much, it still takes probably twice as long to air it up with the pump, but it's way less energy. I don't know, I'm still not sure what's best yet. How's it going over here? Um, it's definitely a workout. <laughs> it's like your arms, your abs. Um, yeah, you're supposed to have this little thing, supposed to be up to 15. Oh jeez. So. You're, uh, you're not there. <laughs> I'm not sure if it's more trouble than it's worth. I don't know, that's what we're trying to figure out. It's there you go, babe, where it. you at? Where you at? Okay, you're at 10. Get it, Hensley, push it. Push it. Push it. Oh, it's done. It's, it's done. done. <laughs> so I had to top off each stand-up board with the hand pump because our gauge on the Vire electric pump does not show accurately what the PSI is in there and I definitely don't want to blow this up. Having to get out the electric pump and still use the hand pump. I'm gonna say it took around the same amount of time, maybe a little longer actually with the pump because we had to get the pump stuff out. But less effort. I'll say it's less effort, more time to do it this way. But maybe we can get it faster next time. You two ready to do this? Let's do it. <laughs> Hensley, you seeing all these turtles? That baby's riding with the mama turtle just like you're riding with your mama. Look at all these, Hensley. Whoa. Did you have fun, babe? I loved it. That's exactly why I wanted those boards was because we've ran into some cool places and we haven't got to get out on the water. And there are rental places, but not all the time are there rental places. So that was really fun. So that's the pro, lots of fun. The con is it took us 20 plus, maybe 30 minutes. Sounds like there's a rave behind us. Um, <laughs> it's Camp Gladiator over here. Um, making me feel really lazy. 
some sort of CrossFit thing or something. But uh, yeah, 20, 30 minutes to set up and I gotta deflate these things. They're probably 20, 30 minutes to take down. That's it's kind just, of a bummer. We thought it would be a little bit faster than the kayak. I think if we had one, it would be faster. That's true. But because with two boards, it takes just as long. Crazy to think about how different life was the last time that we come and got our picture made in front of the Austin mural. We were just starting this journey on the road, hadn't been on the road that long, so it's crazy to think yeah. like how life has changed and we're redoing things and then, I don't know, it's really fun. Pierre. Kinsley, you want a donut? Uh-huh. Do Gordos donuts make you dance? Uh-huh. <laughs> The restaurant that we go to doesn't have oh, the same options. Oh. Yeah. Which one we go with? I'm trying something new. Heavenly hash. Uh, marshmallows, brownies, chocolate chips, brownie batter. Should we like add this to our list of accomplishments? Like we want to go to every state, we want to go to every national park, and we want to try every Gordo's donut. Should we add that to our, <laughs> we're our we're agenda? Close. We're, we're, we're close. close <laughs> we're close. <laughs> You gotta move them. <laughs> Don't let me hit them. <laughs> Try to hit them. Try to hit them. No, on top. Try to hit on top. <laughs> you gotta move them. Move your hands. Move them. Move them. Does it make you dance? Mm, 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 mm. There you go. The donut make you dance. <laughs> Donuts making me dance. Let's see if it makes mommy dance. You ready to go up a mountain? No. Oh. <laughs> it's a city. You want the city, you don't want the mountain? But it's a really pretty view at the top of these stairs. They look pretty straight up. And it's the highest point in Austin. It can't be any worse than like the Manitou incline we did in Colorado Springs, right? Count them, Hensley. Four. Four. Five. <laughs> We're almost there. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not getting us into something like that again. Although we're not going to break any records on the time. Way to the top! Um, yeah, not quite. <laughs> this is going to take forever. I'm climbing down the wall. This is the stairway. Almost yeah. there! You yeah. did it! <laughs> I love seeing places at different angles. You know, earlier in Austin, we were in Zerker Park down here on the water, and we got to sort of look up at the city in the distance uh, back here. But now, you know, we're up higher looking down on the city. That's a big part of traveling for us, is getting to see things in different angles that maybe we didn't get to see before. I know Grand Canyon's kind of on our list. Every time I've seen it, I've had to look down in the canyon. I cannot wait until we get the permit and go down in that canyon and then be looking up uh, from down below. here. I'm glad that one of the locals pointed this out because last time we were in Austin we didn't get to do these hikes and they're really short and great views. It's really fun. It's kind of crazy just like 
you got rush hour going on down here in Austin and we're just kind of up here above it all, you know, <laughs> kind of peacefully, somewhat peacefully looking at everything. So Isn't this so pretty? It's just a different perspective. Mm -hmm. You can see the bridge. I've always had a thing for bridges. Mm -hmm. They're one of my favorites. My dad used to build bridges. So I think they've always just really interest me and been super cool. I love them and I love the water. How's she doing? Come here. She oh, did yeah. Good. good job, Hensley. The city's never ceased to amaze me on all the different things you can do. I mean, this is our second time doing Austin, and like, it just felt like a whole new city almost, like all the stuff we did. Even though we did some of the stuff, like Gordo's, we some had to do Gordo's same. again. We'll always have to do Gordo's. You can't come to Austin, that's like our favorite. I think it's amazing that they serve donuts out of something that we live in. Pretty cool. Yeah, no, we didn't think of that at all when we were here last time. Um, if our um, Airstream made donuts, hmm. that would be awesome. Well, we, I don't know, we could figure something out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't downplay going to a place two times. Even if you've already been somewhere, there's still some really cool things to do. So much to and, see um, and do. Each time we, it seems like each time we do an area, we think, man, there was something we missed. There's so Next much to time. see in the U.S., so much to see. That's how we kind of cope with that, too, when we're mm -hmm. like, oh, we're we leaving, missed yeah. something, and we're like, yeah. we'll be back. And, yeah. you know, that's kind of happened this time around, and we saw new things, and it was really cool. Mm -hmm. I'm sure we'll be back Glad to be back. again. Yeah. yeah. We're wrapping up our day. We're actually um, eating at, what's this place called? County Line Barbecue. County Line Barbecue. Uh, we're meeting some patrons here from Patreon. Hazel, you want to come say goodbye? Bye. <laughs> say bye from Austin. Bye from Austin. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to call it a day. We're going to get some uh, Texas barbecue. And we will catch you guys later.